Welcome to another in the Perfect Laser series of tutorials. Today we're going to show you how to use your Corel Laser software with Corel Draw to cut and engrave on an item. We're going to do a keyring today. So you uh, grab the, the rectangle tool and get yourself more or less the size you want of a keyring. Grab the shape tool and round the corners of it so that you have more or less the shape that you want and we'll zoom in on it so that we'll get a better view. Now our keyring needs a hole, so let's hold the control key and make it about a five millimeter somewhere around there hole and we'll put it about two and a half millimeters from the edge fraction. I like to combine items when I'm working with them so the two together you can go to object combine or press Control L, you now have one item that is combined. So that's our outline. Now we want to put in some text. Let's say that we're doing this for Fred and we're going to call it Fred's Books, Fred's Keys. And we want to give Fred a nice looking keyring, so we'll give him a nice bold font for Fred, Fred's Keys, and place it nicely. In the center. Now if you were to try and engrave this and then cut you'll end up with a piece of wood that's got that on it. Not very pleasant. So we rather will show you how to do this properly. The laser needs a reference of where to start and therefore you need to take the outline as well as the engrave and send that off to the machine. So if we select the outline we go to the right of the screen. On the right here, you see you've got your color bars. Uh, your left click will give this thing a fill, whatever it is that you've got. And so in this case, we want to remove that outline. Go to the little X, remove the outline. And now select both items, the cut and the engrave. So you'll see it's got a bigger select bar, or the selection is bigger than just that. And if you now go to engrave on your Corel laser toolbar, I don't have a machine connected, but still you'll see that we have Fred's keys sitting over there. Let's just show you that it's sitting away from the edge. It's away from the edge. So the machine knows that there is something there, but because Corel laser will only laser anything that's not white, it won't actually do that outline. So now you can go ahead and engrave. In this case, I'm going to cancel it because I don't have a machine connected. And then you come back to here once the engrave is done. And if you click on your outline and select it, and then go back to your color bar and with the right mouse click, give it the outline. Now we just have the outline selected. We go to the cut and you'll see there's your little outline. Now simply pressing starting here, once you have your speed and your power correct, will cut exactly where you want it to. Quite easy, isn't it?